I just furred the edge, basically took it, bent it up. Wow, on nice. All the edges, and I just gotta get it fit into one of the closets here. Pretty close. So you're just gonna take a pair of pliers and just adjust it until I get it tight enough. Most of the stuff you're seeing is going to be stuff for the kitchen, uh, some stuff for the parlor too, like the Japan items. Shop like this, even at the size, you can see it's putting out somewhere around 15,000 items a year. So, it's a decent little factory. different meats and we also put dessert on the table at each meal so it's there as part of the meal and provides a lot of calories since they were very active during the day. Noontime is called dinner and that's also a very large meal. Meats, vegetables, breads, grains, desserts. And now the fireplace has been banked so we're not no longer cooking and nighttime is more of a, a snack or a cold leftover so you might have a piece of leftover meat or perhaps um, some bread and cheese. Mm -hmm. What time is breakfast? Breakfast is really early, especially in the summertime. Yeah. <laughs> you know, like all weather, you don't want to be cooking. You get yeah. out, uh, get the, take advantage of the earlier, cooler, cooler weather. What time? So it'd be about five or six. six. Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Early by five, yeah. 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 <laughs> yep. I work nights, so. Hey. Um, <laughs> yeah. I try not to uh, eat late at night. I yeah. have to switch that up. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah. I get very hungry. Like close in the afternoon. Yes, the afternoon. Yeah. 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 Mm -hmm. oh, At night, I kind of have to cut back, not so much. Should I so, regret it later? Yeah, that's true. <laughs> Anything that's left over from the big noon meal, the meat and vegetables, they chop it up, grind it up into a dish called mince meat. Yeah. Today we would call it hash. Corned beef hash, okay, yeah. hash. <coughs> Shake up, but it's new. <laughs> we did eggs and toast and a lovely apple pie today for breakfast. Nice.
parlor that's off to the two doors down is the visitor parlor and that's where you come as visitors to the home into that room because it's the best room kind of made you know designed to be the place where you impress people you know um, and then this room was the last room added on and it's a beautiful kitchen big kitchen and in 1838 you wouldn't be allowed in the kitchen because uh, it's the workhorse of the of the house so we have doors on this room uh, and on the parents' bedroom, so if someone's visiting in the parlor, we can close the doors and no one can see the action of the household. So, yeah, you're welcome. <laughs> 